this is a video that supplements our lesson today on Skype um, going over that C major Mozart sonata, the K545. Um, what I would do to reinforce the phrasing is just a little snapshot of the, um, the bass line in, in chords so that you know that you're, you're leading on the dominant here, resolving the tool. And then lean on the four chord, resolve it down, and leaning on the resolve it down. And then you'll know what to do with the melody because it's threaded through that harmony. So you want to make sure, you know, you get the Mozartian kind of flavor, singing tone, this kind of to this part, make sure um, that you don't um, emphasize the downbeats of the section because it may be a downbeat, but it's definitely lifted up where you have Make sure you do that. That's a surprise there. something of the G minor surprise. We don't expect it. Now you asked me about this part um, and how to articulate it. I, I generally at measure 11 go da -da -bum -bum -da -bum -bum. I don't do oh detach here bum 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 da -da -bum -bum -bum. Second thing, I um, actually observed the, the grouping in my music, which is a slur of two going to the dotted quarter, so you get Remember I told you to do that? So that you um, hear the moving voice in the left hand. What you don't want is too many thumbs. It's easy to go da di do 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 di You don't want that. You don't want so many D's, so subdue so your thumbs there. And you did this very well today. You ironed out the. Um... Um, and do it slowly so you hear. Of this other part that we talked about today, um, I've envisioned the melodies on top and there's harmony on the bottom. Even though it's broken chords, they still have a harmonic dimension for me. And, and if you play the chords and block them, you hear a little counter melody almost going through the, the, the whole chord. notes of the quarter notes, and you phrase them, the second one of the pair down like this. When I say phrase it down, I mean among the pairs phrase down. I, would, I wouldn't do a diminuendo there across all of them. No, I would just do, I would just phrase it like that, you know, lean. shape the line actually. Um, so you can also you can also do a, a little subdivision of this practicing process by going and know the harmonies. The one chord, the four chord, the five, the and that would be the three chord. Take that back. This would be the three chord. Would be the six or two, five, one. Sounds like a, a, a sounds like.
gain deceptive cadence there. But um, going from uh, this, he dropped down to this. That's not six chords, it's three chords. But anyway, it kind of feels like it's so deceptive there because we don't expect a five chord to go anywhere but a, a tonic. So you have to make that a surprise when you do it. Um, so, that, so that's the main thing. Okay, the other thing I noticed on this page um, that my music has that yours probably doesn't, where you have this da I slur, like my music says. That's very Mozartian. So then this falls into place. up the uh, development section picks up the idea of the, the arpeggios at the end there, or the arpeggios. <laughs> Takes that idea to the minor, right? I would do that really passionately. And forte. Lift them. Remember, dominant, tonic. Um, don't come crashing down on, on tonics. Because that's that conversation now that you have between the hands is the scale. So you're rolling into the scale and one hand is rolling down in the other. So going up, going down in conversation. And um, soft. Too slow in the measure before it can be dragged down a little bit. The tempo. Lean horizontal. Lean on four. Four chord, one chord. Lean. Now here um, you have the beat for the um, uh, F major. Um, and in the F major, you want to do the same thing you did um, when you did it in C major in terms of this. bottom and the chords are on top so you've inverted the counterpoint <laughs> C major. Let's look at deceptive cadence here. We don't expect it. It doesn't have to be a six chord. Um, and then here, Now 
going to come back to what you did before, except we're going to see major. Do you do That's pretty much what we're working on.